friends, nerdlings. Well, we have a little kind of different kind of toy unboxing for you today. You know how they have fidget spinners and fidget cubes? Well, they've made one that's kind of geared a little bit more towards gamers, and it's called the Super Fidget. And it's definitely designed around the, as you can see, the NES uh, little controller there. So let's open this up and take a look at it. We also <laughs> have just kind of a little extra sneak peek, or not sneak peek, but a little extra bit. We found a uh, PlayStation-themed fidget spinner. <laughs> we we weren't actually uh, looking to get a fidget spinner no, or anything, definitely but wanted a fidget spinner. when we saw this, we couldn't pass it up because uh, it's very cool. You know, seeing the classic PlayStation yeah. button layout on there, so it's like, oh, okay, we, we can go for that one. Yeah. So, let's take a look at it. All right, so here's a closer look at it so that you can really see what each little feature does. So as you can see, it's got the D-pad on it, and it's just very typical D-pad, the B button, the A button, and then you've got these little toggles over here, and there's like a, each one of them does a threefer, so. That's for the turbo mode. <laughs> yeah, and then on the side here, you've got like a button that you push, and it'll stay in, you push, and it stays out. So that mm. one's kind Don't of Don't show fun. the doctor that. He does love his He big does love the big red buttons. And then, you know, you've got the, the joystick for the more uh, new gamer esque. And not only do they rotate just like a normal joystick, push down like like the new joystick ones. On the bottom, you can see here there's a little wheel, clicky wheel that spins. Then when you flip her all the way over, yes, yeah, like this fidget spinner in the back. There is a roller ball that you can just roll around or click it. it. Gives you a nice satisfying click. And then here's literally just a click pad. Nice, again, good satisfying button clicks. It's part of, probably one of my favorite parts. And then if you wanted to lanyard, put it on like a necklace or your backpack or whatever, you've got the lanyard spots. But anyway, super fun. And of course it's great for practicing your Konami code. Yeah. Here, you wanna you wanna do your Konami code? Oh, go for it. No, you let's do it. let's test you. We have up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. B A or is it A B or B A? B A. B A start select. <laughs> I don't know if I did right and left in the right direction because the camera's <laughs> backwards. So I may have done it on the wrong side. But at least I said it right. <laughs> anyway, so yeah. Well, guys, what'd you think? Did you like it? Did you think you're going to run out and get it? I got it just because it looked video gamey, but I actually really enjoy playing with it. There's a lot of my favorite buttons and stuff on it, so I uh, I especially need this when uh, someone over here is doing something a little oh, intense on man. a video game. I was, uh, <laughs> I was going through the dark side and the darker side of the moon on Super Mario Odyssey, and it's funny because I can always tell when she's getting just as nervous as I am. Because he hears... <laughs> Yeah. Or some kind of clicky noise of some form or another. <laughs> but I will it say this. It keeps me quiet. Yes. It keeps does me from keep going, her quiet. <gasps> oh, oh, ee, ee. So, yeah. <laughs> there are a lot of jumps that. I uh, cease to sound like an ape. <laughs> there are a lot of jumps that I end up missing because she freaks me out when I hear her gasping behind me. I think he's going to fall off. <laughs> or Mario or something. But yeah, anyway. it's, uh, it's actually very cool. I really like it. Yep. The color scheme, obviously, that they went for uh, because it has that you know, classic NES controller look. And it was just a really clever idea. You know, kind of the, the same thing with this, putting the PlayStation face buttons on there mm -hmm. as the you know design for the different wheels and everything. But it's such a simple design, but it works so well. You know, definitely that NES controller is timeless. Yeah, so let us know in the comments below, guys. Do you play with fidget spinners or fidget cubes? Or are you going to run right out and get the super fidget now that you know that there's a game-related one? Uh, you know, what do you do when you're in intense situation in video games? <laughs> Let us know in the comments below what's the best way that you can think of that gets you past those super scary intense video game moments. And don't forget to like our video here. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel because we got a lot more fun things coming your way. Always. So, I think we're fun. Sometimes. Sometimes we're fun. Haven't we done this joke before? Yeah. We don't have very many jokes in our <laughs> repertoire, though. <laughs> Bye, nerdlings. See you later. What, puppy? Are you hungry? Are you hungry? You want some dinner? 
Let's go eat one of the fidget spinners.